Hello, my name is Grace Ma. I'm a voice teacher, a Jiu-Jitsu practitioner, and a clinical hypnotherapist. This video is in response to the concerns of people I've spoken to with elderly parents who are getting increasingly forgetful. The first thing you can do to help someone with a forgetfulness project is to hold their middle finger. You can hold the right or the left middle finger. The recommended therapeutic time is 20 minutes for each finger. This may be difficult in practice, so any time you can get is great. You can also get them to hold their middle fingers themselves if possible. Repeat every eight hourly. Some folks with forgetfulness projects might also have IV drips in their hands, making holding fingers very uncomfortable. Here's another way for you. Place your right hand on the top of the head. Place your left hand between their eyebrows. Leave your hands in these positions for 20 minutes. Practically, this might feel weird or uncomfortable to the person you are working on. If they move away or are reluctant to let you work on them, get as much time as you can and gradually increase the duration. You can work at the level of the hip line. The hip line indicates the state of the physical body. Hold the right pinky finger for 20 minutes. The breath should deepen if holding that finger works. Deepening of the breath indicates that the body's healing response has kicked in. You can hold the person's left pinky finger for 20 minutes if you like. Repeat eight hourly. Harmonizing the exhale is another effective thing you can do. Most people don't exhale. We like to hold things in, hold things back, and not let things go and flow. It's the same for forgetfulness projects. You want the forgetfulness to move on. Hold the person's thumbs for 20 minutes each. To harmonize the exhale, repeat every eight hourly. Please note that the changes might not take place immediately upon harmonization. Some forgetfulness projects might have been very active for a long time. Jinjinjutsu helps stuck conditions start moving. How long it'll take depends on how much there is to move. Have patience and faith. And as always, please check with a medical professional to rule out that there is nothing more that medicine can do for that project. Jinjinjutsu is a complementary healing modality. It is very important that you rule out potentially dangerous underlying causes such as brain tumors first, because these might need urgent attention. Please feel free to ask me any questions in the comments below. I'll help you if I can. Thank you for watching and we wish you the very best of health.